Uh, Catholic schools in the city are closing due to declining enrollment and financial strain. The superintendent now calling for support as five schools in the Brooklyn Diocese are preparing to close their doors. PIX 11's Corey McGinnis has the story. We're closing four, uh, five Catholic schools. Deacon Kevin McCormick, the superintendent of schools for the Brooklyn Diocese, announcing Friday the closure of five more Catholic schools. The closures are effective at the end of the school year. The situation really comes down to two things. First is the declining enrollment, and with declining enrollment comes a, 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 a crippling debt and deficit that goes through that. Deacon McCormick highlighted the vital role Catholic schools play in nurturing well-rounded individuals for the future. What, what the Catholic school does is it gives us a, 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 a cutting edge academics, it gives a dignified discipline, and it also gives a, a, a rooted in a Catholic imagination. Uh, it allows people to see uh, the grace of God in the midst that they do. And it's an uneven playing field, according to McCormick. He says newer charter schools get full funding, while established Catholic schools have to compete with limited resources. And we also have a, a big competition with charter schools, which are funded by state and city uh, uh, coffers, and Catholic schools, which have a proven record for almost two centuries, um, we're out of the loop on that. The diocese launched this website to assist students and parents in locating schools in their area. Any payments made for the 2024-25 school year are set to be refunded, and new registration fees will be waived according to the website. While addressing the financial strain faced by Catholic schools compared to charter schools, Deacon McCormick makes a plea for alumni, donors, and the community to financially support Catholic schools, recognizing their value in educating future generations. We need people who are graduates of Catholic schools, of the grammar schools, of the high schools, of the colleges, to support the, the, the system, to support, to put their money into the system so that we can give teachers reasonable wages and we can keep tuitions affordable for our families. Now, McCormick says each of the schools will finish the school year for a list of all the schools that will be closing at the end of the year. We have that information listed on our website at PIX11.com. Just click on this story. Reporting in Brooklyn, Corey McGinnis, PIX11 News.